A magic reward seals that door. What happened here, mercenary? What happened here? The ward killed my comrade. Not easy to do to a dusk saber. Care for their stranger. Whatever three cursed spell trap the old magister placed on that door kills vampires like us rather efficiently. But I don't recognize you. You're not a dusk saber. Did Master Shelreni send you to help us? Nalia tried to push through the ward on that door. The note over there suggests that something in this room disarms the trap. Clearly, she guessed wrong. I think this strange lens is part of the puzzle. We found it by the note. Here, you take it. We obviously weren't able to figure it out. I'll be damned if I try to use it again. If Shoreni sent you, by all means, be my guest. I'm just going to stand back here. Lenses such as that can reveal hidden things. Look through it, Proxy. Look for anything glowing. That should be the switch to dispel the ward. The ward is gone. Master Shalreni must be informed at once. This is our opportunity. Lead the way, Proxy. This portal should take us to the tower. We have reached the lower level of the tower. There should be more portals to take us higher, Proxy. And keep going, Proxy. Insult enough! 
Now she sent you to steal my book! Is this spirit actually Melm the Maltes? Perhaps he is the thread that led us here. If there's one thing I learned in death, it's how foolish the living can be. I know all that passes in my home, intruder. I heard your bargain with that so-called master, Sherani Barreau. You have given my murderer access to my tower. Why does a Telvani do anything? Ambition, power, greed. Twenty years ago, I stood in Sherani's path. An obstacle to the higher rank she craved. She requested a meeting. Instead of negotiating, she killed me and tried to steal my prized possession. Oh, just all the contingencies I had in place. With my last breath, I banished her from the tower and set all the wards and defenses. They held perfectly well until you mucked everything up. I shall have no trouble stealing my black book now. The Tormenting Eye, a tome of forbidden secrets. I see Hermaeus Mora's mark on you and your companion. If you don't know about the black books, she can tell you more. Uh, Sharoni Barreau is careless in her pursuit of power. She must not possess my book. Two things protect my book. The spell of eligibility I cast upon it. And the fact that without my aid, it will take her time to break the spell on her own. Still, I'd rather she never get her hands on it. Stop her, and I'll find a way to reward you. The thread becomes clear. Hermaeus Mora sent us to recover the Black Book. The Black Book is mine. And with this soul gem, I also have this miserable spirit. Meln comes with me. And I thought this day couldn't get any worse! I knew. The threads of fate here are tied to three things. Master Shell Rennie, Melm the Mouthless, and the Black Book. That was the connection to Apocrypha I sensed here. Black Books are creations of Hermaeus Mora and his realm. Black books are relics of Apocrypha. Each holds a different secret. Most are kept in the vast libraries of Hermaeus Mora's realm, but he sometimes gifts one to a mortal. In addition to forbidden knowledge, each serves as a portal to Apocrypha. That is a secret the one who knows has not yet shared with me. I can count the number of black books I know about on one hand, and each is unique. Only one copy of each book exists. This is the first I have heard of one titled The Tormenting Eye. We must free Melm the Mouthless from Master Shelrenny's grasp and retrieve the Black Book. But to do that, we need more information. Look around, Proxy. If Melm was indeed murdered here, there might be proof of Shelrenny's villainy. <laughs> 